A Des Moines woman has a really cool reason to watch the Olympic track and field competition Thursday. Her grandson is going for the gold in the 800 meters right there in Tokyo. KCCI's Marcus McIntyre spoke with his grandmother today and the Olympian's father. Marcus. Steve Stacy, Isaiah Jewett will compete in the preliminary heats of the men's 800 meters tomorrow night. He has a support system right here in Des Moines that will be with him every step of the way. How proud are you and how, how much excitement will you have when you watch your son compete in the Olympics tomorrow night? Well, I'm going to be super, super proud. I mean, every time he competes, it, it brings tears to my eyes. Isaiah Jewett's cheering section may be 6,000 miles away from the Olympic Village, but their voices carry. Led by Father John Jewett and grandmother Janice Caldwell. The cheers during Isaiah's 800 meter heat during the Olympics will likely be even louder than when he qualified for the Olympics. I just screamed. I was with my best friend. I was at her house and I did. she screamed and I screamed and we, I mean, we just celebrated at her home. Janice lives in Des Moines and is very proud of her grandson. I want him to win and I'm sure he does too. Isaiah went to high school in California and on to USC for college. John graduated from East High School. He realized his son had something special in 2019 when Isaiah placed fifth at the World Championship Trials at Drake Stadium while failing to place at the NCAA meet. Then I knew you know, he had an opportunity to do it. No matter what happens Thursday night on the track in Tokyo, both grandmother and father agree. Isaiah Jewett is already a winner. He's a better kid than he is an athlete, and that's what I'm very proud of him about. Isaiah has an undergraduate degree from USC and is currently enrolled in a graduate program there as well. Janice and John will be among many friends and family in Des Moines watching Isaiah run tomorrow night. Stacy.